Hello there my friends, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to my Monsanto world. I spawn full playthrough on the PlayStation 5. This is part 33 I believe and I think we've got a couple of things to do to be honest. Um, give me a sec. Right, um, right guys, you see if I speak to the Seeker, I think it's going to trigger off another quest line. I'm not going to do it yet. I'm sure he's going to talk about the Stygian... Zenoga that we fought in the last episode. That was a lot of fun though. A lot of stress though guys because if you remember um, I had an error message come up on my screen and it almost cost me a faint. <laughs> so that wouldn't have been good. Anyway, I forgot to read this out to you. Right, let's just get into this and let's read out that. Okay, here we go. Right, Fanged Wyvern Stygian Zenoga has a symbiotic relationship with dracophage bugs, which it releases like bullets, becomes even more dangerous when covered in light. It powered, it's, sorry, its powered up state is cancelled when it flinches or is toppled. When its hide toughens, it becomes more vulnerable to elemental attacks. So that's where the thunder uh, comes in. But anyway, let's check this out. Okay, when emitting light. So basically when he's uh, doing all that red glowing shit. <laughs> Very cool though, guys. Honestly, it's so cool. Um, he's going to be vulnerable to thunder. Um, one star weakness to thunder otherwise. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, but as you can see there, he's not really weak to anything. A good choice is also blast weapons. Uh, I do remember that now. Okay, let's check out the rewards real quick. Okay, dragon locks. How do I... Do I just get that from calves? All right, so what you want to do is use your capture net. When he's on the floor, um, when it's safe to do so, when you've toppled him, you can actually use your capture net to grab some of those dracophage bugs. And I'm not sure, guys, but I have a feeling he gets weakened, like his dragon elements gets weakened, I think. If anyone can verify that for me, that will be great. But anyway, now what are we doing today? It's just going to be a very quick episode, guys, because I'm trying to clear these um, optional quests. Um, as you can see, I'm level 49 or master rank 49. Now we need to do this quest and I do not genuinely do not remember what it is. So we need to speak to the field team leader. How's it going? How's it going? Very well, thank you. <laughs> hey, looks like things are going smoothly out in the Guiding Lands. <laughs> not really. I've not done anything out there yet, guys. I've got an urgent quest here for the field team. The name's Sleep Now in the Fire. It's out in the ancient forest. Oh, is that all? It must be a Paolumi. Yeah. Our scholars out there are struggling. They said they could use some of that fifth fleet muscle. Taking care of this should free up a lot of resources for the Guiding Lands research. Who knows what new breakthroughs that could net us. We're counting on you, Hunter. Oh, okay, not just a Paolumi, it's also going to be a Rathian as well. So it's called Sleep Now in the Fire, so let's do that today, guys. I need to anyway, because I need to uh, go past a Master Rank 50. I've been following Stygian Zenoga. I had to actually do it through an event. I haven't hunted him again yet. I was just trying to gather his footprints, increase the research, and hopefully open some investigations. But guys, I've been doing that for so long, no investigations were coming up. And I thought that's very unusual. So I have a feeling I need to push my level up. Anyway, so that's what we're going to do now. All right. What is it? A main quest? It is. Okay, sleep now in the fire. So, as you can see, hunt a tempered Rathian and a tempered Paolumi. Um, Nightshade Paolumi, sorry. And that will be 34,560 Zenny. This assignment is only for the few heroic hunters who can handle the rigors of being a true master hunter. Show everyone what you're capable of. Completing this quest unlocks the master rank cap limit. All right, let's do it, guys. <laughs> okay, it's in the Asia Forest. I'll see you over there. All right, guys, we are here. I say we should go after Rathian first. Um, what palicos do we have? Oh, not bug trappers. Well, you know what, guys, then again. Wait a minute. Oh, they're all bug trappers, all of them. 
All right, whatever. <laughs> Let's just uh, grab a bug trapper. They can be quite useful, actually. All right, here we go. Yeah, we'll go after Rathian first. Let's see how we get on from there. I made a build for Paolumu, so all that means is it's still Master's Touch, etc. But it's got Sleep Resist, <laughs> so that will help us quite a lot. Now, where would Rathian be? Let's try it down here first. Anyway, let's get all buffed. I hope everyone's doing well. Hope you had a great week. It's just so cold here in the UK. Um, we're just about to be in March now, so we're approaching March. Um, as well, as I'm recording this, this is like the end of February. Um, okay, I think that's it. We don't have to buff anymore. Okay, that's it. I'm so used to thinking about do I need cool drink or hot drink. Okay, so I made that. Nothing special, it's just really dragon elements. Um, what about this? Should I do pitfalls? Let's do pitfalls, guys. Let's do that. Yeah, it's, it's so cold here. It's unbelievable, man. All right, grab that. Now, normally Rathian is here. Now, if she's not, that's fine. I just need a footprint. Like that. Well, it's the gashes. <laughs> okay. All right, anything come up? Oh, I know where she is. Um, shall I wait for her, guys? I'm crying out loud. Okay, let me let me highlight her first. I know where Paolumi is. Paolumi is in this area here. It's very rare that it moves off um, too far. Okay, let's just jump on a Jagras. <laughs> Okay, the Rathian seems to be moving on the mini-map. I'll tell you what, guys. I'll relax. Let's just trust the uh, Jagras and <laughs> see what happens. Wait, is it coming here, guys? It is. It is. It's here, guys. It's here. Okay. No. Stop. Hey, stop. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. Okay. Okay. Okay, is she going to go down? No, she's not. Oh, damn it, guys. Screw it. Let's just flash her. <laughs> okay, let's turn her. And get in that wall, please. Thank you. Nice. Good opening. I can't see. <laughs> I don't know where her head is. Okay. Oh, my God. Nice. Okay, I've got a KO charm in this as well. In this build, I mean. Oh my god. I'm moving out of position. I don't like that. Oh no, I'm po uh, poisoned. Damn it. Oh crap. Damn it. I thought she was doing something else. Oh, my poor trapper is a bit knocked out unconscious. <laughs> Come on, KO. Oh, damn it, man. I can't reach your head. Uh, guys, I need to get good at this because we're going to face something very tough. Oh, crap. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, good, 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 good. Come on, come on. Okay. That's the only thing about putting the glider mantle, guys. She starts floating. My character, I mean. Oh, shit. Nice. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Okay, here we go. Crap. <laughs> Damn it. No, stop it. Oh my god, stop it, will you? Jesus. 
hate this lawnmower thing they do. Oh crap. Oh god. Oh my stunned. Guys, are you kidding me? Thank you, Kuro. Thank you. Oh, that was a waste. Oh, that was awful, guys. <laughs> well, never mind. But you, you get the idea. You know why I was trying to do that. Please stop it. <laughs> oh, damn me. All right, let's just weaken ahead, I guess. Nice. Okay, lovely. Okay. Ah, I might as well do that to reset. Don't fly, please. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, did, did it not get ahead? Oh, anyway. Yeah, sorry, I had to slightly concentrate for that one, guys, because the amount of damage she was doing to me. And I've actually upgraded my armor as well. Bit concerning. Anyway. All right, so let's jump on a tail raider. Okay, get some dash juice. Oh, she's not far. I thought she's gone very far away. She hasn't. Oh, God. Come on, come on. And quickly, can I squeeze this in? Okay, good. Shoot her. <laughs> that actually worked. Guys, that actually worked. I can't believe it. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay. Oh, my God. I don't believe this. <laughs> okay, it's fine. We're okay. Oh, for Christ's sakes. Okay, good. She's ready. All right, guys. Um, I'm going to go capture her. So, I, what's this? Wrath and Material. Okay, good. All right, I'm going to go capture her. I'll get into my capture master. I'll meet you up there. Hey, guys. Okay, here we are. All right, good. She's asleep, I think. Where the hell is she? Oh, there. I couldn't see her, guys. All right, anyway. Right, let's bag Rathian. And guys, what I'm going to do, I'm going to rebuff and slip into my <laughs> sleep resist armor set and I'll see you where Paolo moves. So I'll be back with you shortly. Hey guys, okay. All right, let's see if we can find this Paolumi. It should be in this area anyway. It's normally in this region. All right, there's footprint. Another footprint. Wait, it shouldn't, is it on the map? It is. All right, check it out. It's always here. Okay, here we go, guys. Okay, let's try and get a KO if possible. All right, here we go. <laughs> Sorry, Aftonoth. <laughs> okay. Okay, grab that. Grab that. <laughs> awesome. All right, let's go to work. Oh, damn it. Yes, we got the knockdown. <laughs> Excellent. Get out of the way, Chagris. It's not your fight. <laughs> nice. We are absolutely devastating this Paolumi. And the thing is, it can't put me to sleep because I've got sleep resist. Oh, no. Oh, crap. I forgot about this, guys. Damn it. I shouldn't be so cocky. <laughs> yeah, do what you want, man. It's not going to make me sleep. Oh, you bastard. <laughs> you piece of shit. Oh, my God. Okay, guys. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. 
Oh, wow. Okay, guys, I'm not going to underestimate it. Jesus. Stop it. Where are you? I guys can't. See. Okay, there it is. Oh, come on. Stop it, man. I'm trying to change this to that. Damn it. I was trying to get a mount. <laughs> yeah, stop all that nonsense. Come on, man. Jeez, I need to heal again. Come on, come on, come on. Go down. Stop being stubborn. Oh, shit. Oh, damn it, man. Dude, seriously? Wow. <laughs> that took a while. All right, there we go. And just a very quick heal. Oh, damn it. Okay. Wait. <laughs> nice. Okay, here we go. Oh my god, these are coming in clutch for me, guys. The traps, I mean. Okay, ideally I want to capture it, but um, we'll see. <laughs> Poor Paolumi. Oh my god, guys, does it have like a million health? Jesus. Okay, I need to re-soften. Turn. Uh, turn again. Will you hit this tree? Please? Yes! <laughs> Excellent. Okay, it's dropped a sling of thorn. It should be ready to capture very soon. No power loomy. It's nothing personal. I don't want to kill you, so... We can do this either the easy way or the hard way. Get out of here, Jagris. It's not your fight, man. Yes! <laughs> Damn it. What happened? Oh, paralyzed. <laughs> yes. Okay, guys, skull icon. It's ready. Okay, I'll see you over here. Um, it doesn't go very far away. Okay, I'll see you in a bit, guys. Hey, guys. Okay, should be here sleeping, I hope. It is. All right, check it out. Jeez, that's some loud snoring. <laughs> anyway, mission accomplished. Uh, these are going to get harder, so every so often, we're going to get an optional quest from the, you know, field team leader... And um, I think we're going to have to fight a tempered Brachydios, which is going to be very difficult. A Glavinus, I think. And um, I, I don't remember the rest. So that will pop up from time to time. It just depends on what level you are. So, But we need to do them to actually advance the game a little bit. All right, let's grab all of that. Guiding Lands region level cap has been removed. Oh, no way. That's awesome. Don't worry, if you don't understand what that means, I'm going to explain all this um, a bit later on when I actually get my ass into the guiding lands to actually farm. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you at Celiana, guys. Hey, guys. Okay, we are back. Check it out. So we're now actually Master Rank 69. Are you kidding? Hey there, partner. Right, okay, I didn't expect myself to be 69. I thought I was going to be in the 50s. <laughs> um, hmm, I'm not sure what to do because, guys, there's going to be another quest, I believe. I'm not sure. 
All right, I was going to wrap up here, but let me just double check. Let's see if the field team leader has anything. No, it must be level 75 then. So anyway, guys, we'll see how it plays out. I'm I'm not sure. I don't remember. It's been, you know, a few years. I may check online later. Right, this will open up two horrifically hard quests. It's going to be way too hard for me to tackle at this stage. But I really want to do them because, A, the fights are one of a kind and fantastic. B, we're going to get some extremely sick gear, <laughs> right? So I don't know if we're ready at the moment. Um, I need to at least augment my, at least my weapon. And we'll see how, I don't know, we'll see how we get on really. Anyway, let's see if Mr. P got me a gourmet voucher. He did, yay! <laughs> Good boy. Give him a few scratches under his chin just to say thank you. <laughs> All right. Okay, guys. Okay, so here's what's going to happen moving forward. Um, I'm going to do a lot of farming. The next episode, I'm going to give you a short example of what to do in the Guiding Lands. In, in case you're new to Monsanto, you just want to get a feel for what it's like out there. But we need to level up different regions. So I also need to... Okay, let me just show you real quick. I don't know if the map's going to show me, but we'll have a look. Okay, see where it says Great Jagras? He's going to be in the Ancient Forest area. I need to actually level that up. Also, there's going to be mining, unique mining and unique, um, I think, bone fossils or whatever. So we need to loot those as well to get some special materials. I will level them up to its highest um, in each region. And I'll show you what to do with all that in a future video. Because there's a way you can farm. You want to uh, farm for dragon coal chunks. I know, it probably makes no sense. Listen, veterans know what I'm talking about, but people who've never played this before, I will reveal all later on, but you will get so many rewards. Um, I'll explain all that. You know, things like gourmet vouchers, melding tickets, um, celestial wyvern prints. I'll explain all of that as I go on, but it's going to be a big info dump if I just explain it, you know, now. You have to actually see it to understand it, if that makes sense. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this episode. It's just a quick optional quest. And um, next episode, we're going to do some farming in the Guiding Lands. But it's not going to be super long. I want to try and unlock Zenoga. Oh, shit. My, right on. Yeah, right on cue. All right, guys. So we're going to unlock Zenoga. And I'm probably going to try an event where you can, you know, farm for amazing decos as well. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed yourselves regardless. Thank you very much for joining me today. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next part. Take care.